Chapter 22 Choose a good reputation over great riches, for being held in high esteem is better than having silver or gold. The rich and the poor have this in common, the Lord made them both. A prudent person foresees the danger ahead and takes precautions. The simpleton goes blindly on and suffers the consequences. True humility and fear of the Lord lead to riches, honor, and long life. The deceitful walk a thorny, treacherous road. Whoever values life will stay away. Teach your children to choose the right path, and when they are older, they will remain upon it. Just as the rich rule the poor, so the borrower is servant to the lender. Those who plant seeds of injustice will harvest disaster, and their reign of terror will end. Blessed are those who are generous, because they feed the poor. Throw out the mocker, and fighting, quarrels, and insults will disappear. Anyone who loves a pure heart and gracious speech is the king's friend. The Lord preserves knowledge, but he ruins the plans of the deceitful. The lazy person is full of excuses, saying, If I go outside, I might meet a lion in the street and be killed. The mouth of an immoral woman is a deep pit. Those living under the Lord's displeasure will fall into it. A youngster's heart is filled with foolishness, but discipline will drive it away. A person who gets ahead by oppressing the poor or by showering gifts on the rich will end in poverty. Listen to the words of the wise. Apply your heart to my instruction. For it is good to keep these sayings deep within yourself, always ready on your lips. I am teaching you today, yes, you, so you will trust in the Lord. I have written thirty sayings for you filled with advice and knowledge. In this way you may know the truth and bring an accurate report to those who sent you. Do not rob the poor because they are poor, or exploit the needy in court. For the Lord is their defender. He will injure anyone who injures them. Keep away from angry, short-tempered people, or you will learn to be like them and endanger your soul. Do not co-sign another person's note or put up a guarantee for someone else's loan. If you can't pay it, even your bed will be snatched from under you. Do not steal your neighbor's property by moving the ancient boundary marker set up by your ancestors. Do you see any truly competent workers? They will serve kings rather than ordinary people.